Hey, hey Marcel, just uh, hey, how good. How are you doing, man? Uh, just uh, how how would you assess spring so far for you and moving back to linebacker? Yeah. How's it going? Yeah. Uh, well, everything's been going really good. Being with Coach G and the new staff, they've been putting me in uh, lethal positions to be able to make plays and things like that using my athletic ability. Uh, I've really been liking it so far. I've been able to play fast and not really think as much in this defense. It's uh, some some difficulties in there a little bit. And just uh, coming back, just being just a tad bit rusty, playing linebacker again from playing receiver for a year. So everything else, though, has been pretty good. Yeah, Marcel, Coach, uh, sorry. Uh, Coach, Coach Stocks had talked about new staff sometimes brings new opportunities for yes, guys. Yes, yes. Um, and he talked about some guys making the most of those opportunities. Do you feel like you're you're one of those guys right now that has given given this chance to go out there and, and make the best of an opportunity for you? Uh, yes, sir. Uh, I feel like a lot of my teammates are all feeling like they're taking the opportunity right now to get better. Uh, I feel like I'm capitalizing on the things that they give me and uh, being able to have a leader and playing a role in being a leader. So just learning how to be a leader this year has been really, really good, especially just being in young, being being here to be able to be in spring and to be able to, you know, take take just taking the, just the coaching. That's all I've been doing is taking in the coaching and just playing football. Also looks like guys are just having a lot of fun out yeah, there, a lot of energy. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Mm -hmm. How much has Coach Cause helped you? Uh, Coach Cause has helped me a lot. Uh, I would say when I came in at first, I really don't like talking about my weight, but I was 180 at first. Now I'm 210, so gained, uh, gained a lot of weight in the last few months. So Coach Cause has actually been a very much help just like with mental health and being able to be healthy too as well. So being able to keep your mind right and, and just he's been perfect. Or so you mentioned it, but Coach Gillespie said it's all about speed. He wants guys to keep it simple and yeah, you just fast. run. Yeah. Do you feel like this kind of suits your style of play? And yeah. kind of going back to high school, you feel like you can kind of live up to the hype, so to speak? Of well, not live up to the hype. Honestly, just really becoming just more of a really good team player. That's really what I'm focused on right now, is becoming a really good team, a team player right now, honestly. And so... Me being suitable to the defense, I feel like a lot of the kids on our team is being able to be suitable to the defense as well. Mm -hmm. When you look around the linebacker room, it looks like there's a lot of talent, a lot yes. of depth yeah. there. What do you think about the, kind of the competition that's going on at linebacker right now? Uh, competition is really good. It actually brings a lot of good good players. You know what I mean? You actually get to see who who's really that dog. You know what I mean? Who really has a dog in them. So uh, them putting us in competitional uh, positions has been very easy to show who's who's capable of making plays, who fits the mic, who fits the wheel, who fits the star, and things like that. How's it been uh, working under Coach Gillespie? What, uh, what is yeah, really how, how's his yeah, yeah. Uh, personality? Uh, his personality is really good. Uh, I, honestly, we match each other like spiritual animals on the field. You know what I mean? Like being able to be uh, uh, just a just a dog and being able to attack things. You know what I mean? He's real fast, real like edgy, and I'm real edgy too. So it just matches the energy that we have. Or so going back to the off season, was it a tough sell to get yeah. you to go back to linebacker? Or did you enjoy receiver? No, or did uh, you kind of know I, defense was your home. Honestly, when I was here the the first two years, I honestly don't think they knew where to put me. Mm -hmm. Honestly, and so they didn't know where to put me, and it was very hard to find a home and a position. If you know what I mean. It was just really hard, honestly. I don't really like talking about I like talking about the new staff and what they given me and what the opportunities they gave me, and it's just been a blessing. Mm -hmm. Marcel, do you think because of that though, there's a yes. chance that a lot of people don't really know what you're capable yeah. of? Yeah. Yes. 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 Very much so. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not playing on the. I came from being a national champion to coming to school and not playing for two years. And, and then and now what, we're playing linebacker, and it doesn't look like anything changed. So what's your yeah. goals this upcoming season now? My goal is to win a national championship with this team that we have. I don't really don't have any eye goals this year. I really am worried about the team becoming the best team in the country. Do you think you've started to see that develop over 10 spring practices? We still have we still uh, we still have to work really really hard to get where we need to be. We have this we have a really big gap, and every day we're closing it, taking steps by steps. It, Jamie mentioned it, that you're having fun again and yeah. the team's having fun. I yeah. mean, it, just what is it about? Like, it, are guys relearning to love football, so to speak? We're building a culture. Mm -hmm. that, that's what we're doing. We're building a culture. And it's fun when you're building a culture. What, and for you, just how fun is it to make those impact plays? You had a pick today. Yeah. You've gotten sacks. Yeah. I mean, yeah. it seems yeah. like you're very active in yeah. this defense, too. Uh, Yeah. It's, just really, it's been really fun. I've been really, really, mm -hmm. really, really enjoying the new staff. Coach Dykes, you know what I mean, being the dude. Coach Kaz, Coach G, really everybody, from the players to the offensive side to everything. It's all honing me to be a better player.
<laughs> this is going to be a tough question. Mm -hmm. You and Landon both wear zero. Mm, yes. Who's, who's going to change? We'll see. We'll see, <laughs> we'll see what, what, what Marcel's going to be in. Okay. You, you've mentioned the new staff quite a few times, but when you look at uh, Coach Gonzalez and Coach mm -hmm. Kelly and, and Coach yeah. Meacham, how important were they in the transition as far as like, stability? I feel like they goes? were a part of making people feel at home for right now mm -hmm. as we are finding a new coach. As right now, we're all comfortable now. You know what I mean? And those are a big part, you know what I mean, in the wide receiver room with Kelly, being able to have Q and all those guys stay together, you know what I mean? Coach G being able to coach the safeties and being able to use his – being able to be free and coach, you know what I mean, for him, you know what I mean, not being under Coach P as long. So everything everything has been doing really good. I feel like they're all having fun to the coaches, to the players. Obviously, you played wide receiver last year, but you yes. played with some guys that play on Sundays when you're at LSU. How good yeah. is Quentin Johnson at the college level? Quinn, I, I would say, I would say, out of everybody that I had competition with in college, I, I think Quinn was the most athletic player that I had to go against for the whole that whole time being going against somebody. I guess being the number two under him. So, <laughs> from, a, from a defensive perspective, what are your what are your thoughts on what you've seen from the offense this spring? Uh, I feel like I feel like right now they're like I feel like weeks. I feel like I feel like we're really making the defense. I feel like we're really making the offense really better, and I feel like they're making us better too with some of the players that they got because they do have utility players. But I feel like right now, just how fast we're moving as players and being able to move fast and not think, I feel like it's kind of helping them more a little bit, like getting getting ready for other teams that's going to be flying around and hitting in them zones and things like that. Well, Marcel, you mentioned being a leader. I yes, mean, sir. it seems like uh, you kind of like being, bringing that energy and, yes. and uh, yeah. kind of the know, energy guy. talking. I got to be the energy man. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. got to be the energy yeah. guy. Yeah, got to bring the energy every day. Even if it's a sad Tuesday, sad Wednesday, whatever it is, I got to bring the energy. I got to be that guy. Yeah, mm -hmm. at 6 a.m. Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> we, we talk about the energy a lot. This We've all seen it. We, we've been out there watching a bit. It seems like you guys have a lot of energy when mm -hmm. there's fans out there, especially on oh, Saturday. Yeah, on How Saturdays, much do you guys like that yeah. as players? We really actually, actually, we really appreciate that, honestly. Uh, a lot of it brings a lot of the competition out of us, honestly. And it kind of keeps us on our toes. And it works for us to come out on Saturday. You know what I mean? Some of them young guys out there being to be around people, you know what I'm saying? Really young, you know what I mean? So them taking advantage of that, with, you know what I mean? Because, you know, last year we didn't really have that, unfortunately. But now we have the blessing to be able to be around people to get, even NIL deals, you know what I mean? With people being out there, being able to watch us and to be able to see who's number zero, who's number nine, who's these players, you know what I mean, behind the scenes. So This might be a hard question, but is it, is it easier for you to – come to practice this year, are you having more fun than yes. any time you've been here? Yes. This is the, the best time I've ever been at TCU. How's it been adjusting to the early morning practice? Very easy, because I'm, I'm ready to get to go. Like, like I said, I wake up with energy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then you got the rest of the day. more questions. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Then you've got the rest of the day. What, what has the team been, you know, going to bed early probably helps with that a little yeah, bit. I'll, I'll probably go to sleep around like 9.30. Late homework yeah. nights, probably like 10. Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. Thank you, Marcel. Thanks, Thanks, man. Thanks.